the, the challenge in the market in terms of the supply from our analysis has been, and this is you know, reflected in the work of the, the task force on voluntary carbon markets and, and the leadership of Mark Carney and others in this space, uh, the market's very fragmented. It's very much a sort of small-scale demonstration artisanal business. Um, it's uh, supply constrained, certainly. So the large buyers, companies like Shell, that have $450 million set aside to invest in nature-based solutions and credits, simply can't find enough product right now. So there's a transition at the moment where an industry that's been you know, small scale, a few thousand hectares at a time, led by NGOs, is transforming into an industrial scale commodity sector, resource sector. And that's, that's very much where we're involved um, as a company. So we use contract structures and financing mechanisms that will be more familiar to the oil and gas sector, to securing concessions and surface rights, to, to having offtake structures and agreements and farm out agreements that, that are used in the oil and gas sector to fund early development, but are now being used really in the nature-based solutions and carbon.